Uh, Will, yes. you could use the paper in front of you to draw your typical electrician. Can you please draw your idea of an electrician? Could you just draw your typical electrician, please? Hold up to the camera for us. So, what's your electrician called? It's called Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Lee Rice grumpy sometimes. <laughs> Why did you draw a man? Uh, good question. I don't know. Like, most electricians are men, aren't they? That's what I would associate with an electrician, like, the majority of them do seem to be men. I just feel like it's generally a male-dominated role. Because they typically are men, aren't they? All oh, right, okay, so do you want me to just pull it through? Yeah, through. You will help me there. I'm more than 100% certain new regs require a live neutral nerve at every point. Maybe so. What, what problems are you running into at the minute? Roger being an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> just basically different ways of wiring, just like coming into problems with the fact that we're just wiring things differently and just making sure that we both know what's going on. Because we haven't actually got a cable drawing for this like cabinet. We're having to sort of pull the wires in to what way that we know. So we're just sort of discussing which would be the best route for the cables. Both ideas would work, but obviously yeah. this one, Roger's explained, would be a lot more beneficial for if there was a fault to happen. So, so did you enjoy what you do here then? Yeah, I do enjoy my job. Um, it's my job's tiring at times. Like, uh, like men, like physically, it's tiring because it's a very like energetic job. But it's also quite tiring mentally as well because you deal with like a lot of a lot of crap generally. Like sometimes you do. I think you do need to have like a bit of downtime from dealing with the boys' banter and so on because. It gets to the point sometimes where you just you're exhausted. You've spent so much time together that you start to like resent each other. Um, but we all get like that. I feel like I'm just more emotional towards it sometimes. That's what he needs. Put on the brown and green. Yeah. Yeah, and the blue. Please. Other one. Other one. That's it. So basically that's the cables installed for the lights. We just need to connect up now and then we we'll turn the lights on. I'm a sparky girl in a man's world. Life is plastic. It's fantastic. You can brush my hair, pull cables everywhere. So I'm a fully qualified electrician, but obviously it's just something different from what is the norm for a girl to be doing, I guess. Um, whenever I go on courses, it's very rare that we have a female on the course. Like When I went to college, it was me and 11 boys. So it's quite nice when you go on a job or on a course and you see a girl on site, it's sort of like, like a bit of girl power. I love musical theatre too. Can you give us a sound? Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this is generally where I work from. So you've got my hand, you've got my drills, my angle grinders, fixings, uh, 110 gear, cable at the back. Um, but yeah, this is just sort of where I work from. I like it to be clean and tidy. And when the boys borrow my van, it is always a mess. Hands down, just a mess. So I've, I've not letting them borrow my van anymore. I'm using Abigail's tools because Abigail has the best tools. <laughs> and you never bring yours, do you, Roger? That's right, I don't see the point. Abigail, what other tool you take? Old tools. No, old tools, new tools, no tools. Well, <laughs> Last year for 
I think it was like International Women's Day. Um, I got asked to go and talk at uh, Durham and I went and spoke at the uh, council chambers at Durham Council. And one of the girls um, <coughs> that spoke after I'd spoke, she was like, oh, I want to be a female electrician now. And I was like, oh, so that was quite nice, actually. And a lot of the time, I guess, if a girl is in this line of work, she might make a lot more money than her boyfriend or she, she might make a lot more money than her parents or I, I don't know, like you, you, a girl in a blue collar job can make more money. It's a man's world, basically. Like it's a girl in a man's world. He makes money. So if you would just use the paper in front of you just to draw yep. your typical electrician. Electrician, um, okay. And just maybe give, give them a name, maybe think about a character trait you would uh, maybe associate with them. Okay. Electrician, what do they wear? Would you just show that uh, straight to the camera for Yeah, us? this is Sandra, the and electrician. Why did you draw a female? Oh, just because I instantly went to male and then I thought, but why have I instantly gone to male? Why can't it be a female? Okay. So I challenged my stereotypical thinking. Well, thank you very much. And I think that if other girls want to do that and they can see that future, then I hope that they do sort of not look up. Yeah, I guess look up to me. Yeah, in a nice way. Yeah.